Hi, this is Paul Sveta of Windows Phone Central. Here with a quick look at VGBC8 for Windows Phone 8. This is a Game Boy and Game Boy Color emulator. It comes from the creator of SNES 8X and VGBA8. So uh, the interface is very similar to those. Uh, to get ROMs on your phone, you would need to upload them to your SkyDrive account, and then you can manually download them all through here. And you've got a quick list of the ROMs you'd like to play. This is the games you've played most recently. That's handy in case you have a lot of games. There's a good array of settings that you can adjust, you know, toggling a few little options there. Um, you can adjust your control sensitivity and uh, opacity and size. Um, I wish you could reset it to just the default, but you can't, so you just have to, if you mess with it, you've got to put it back to how you want. Um, and a couple of sound options. Not to mention frame skipping. That's it. Now here we have a, an original Game Boy game in black and white. You can play with it held vertically, which better recreates the actual Game Boy experience. But I like it better like this. As you know, I'm quite a passionate Double Dragon fan. The game runs great. Um, the virtual stick has improved compared to the, uh, the way that it launched on his Game Boy Advance emulator. Although he's, of course, patched that one as well. So I find it a little less unpleasant to use. Still not perfect. Now the one bad thing here, control-wise, is if a game requires you to press A and B at the same time, that's actually pretty hard to do. Um, so you have to, like, use double fingers, probably. There we go. I thought that guy was just going to hit me to death. Now I can choose different save states, or, you know, create one, obviously, or load one. Go back to the main menu. Now, Game Boy Color was an improved Game Boy, you know, a slightly more powerful version of the Game Boy. It could play original Game Boy games. And um, so Nintendo re-released this Zelda game, Zelda Link's Awakening, in a color version to take advantage of the new hardware. It's, you know, the Game Boy Color visuals are slightly more powerful than the regular Nintendo Entertainment System. So the characters still can't be very colorful, but there's a good number of colors on screen, and it's just a charming little look, you know, these older games like this. And Link's Awakening is one of the very best 2D Zelda games. It's long and really interesting, and, you know, plays just fine on the phone. Has some nice little Mario references, like the that guy there. And I think a lot of people will be most interested in an emulator like this to play, you know, the classic RPGs that are available on Game Boy and Game Boy Color. A few old uh, black and white Final Fantasies, you've got Dragon Warrior 1 through 3. A lot of games that play just fine with a touch screen, you know, they're not so action oriented. So if, and of course there's Pokemon. Uh, so if you're interested in in older Game Boy games like this. The simulator currently costs $249, and I really don't have too many complaints about it. It's nice, so give it a download. Thanks for watching. Read the full article at WPCentral.com.